Hello and welcome to the UK Review. Uh, today I'll be unboxing Windows 7 Home Premium. This is an upgrade designed for Windows Vista. So, the, what, in what is included in the box is the DVDs, manual, um, product key number, etc. Um, you get a 32 and a 64 bit discs so if you need a higher processor you can use a 64 if it's a low use of 32 um, you can activate Windows 7 by internet or phone if you haven't got internet connection but the phone I don't think it's free I think it's a premium number um, <coughs> Um, Windows 7 system requirements 1 gigahertz or faster for 32 bit or 64 bit processor 1 gig RAM for 32 64 you need a 2 gig RAM 16 gig available disk space for 32 20 gig for the 64 bit you need a um, direct x9 graphics processor with w um, sorry wddm point 1.0 or higher drivers to run windows 7 home premium um, it just says on the back which windows 7 is best for you you get home premium professional elite ultimate i think it's said um, What's on the home premium one is makes the things you do every day easier with improved desktop navigation, faster and easier to launch programs and find the documents you use more often, make your web experience faster, easier and safer than ever with Explore, Internet Explorer 8, which is very good I have heard. Um, watch, pause, rewind and record TV on your PC or laptop and I know for a fact that you need additional hardware to run that one yeah and it's a bit pricey so if you want to buy it go ahead because it's be it's good but you make, gotta make sure you have a TV license for that because you're watching TV through internet connection um, easier to create a home network and connect your PCs to a printer with home group which is supposed to be good so you can only have one you can have one printer in your house and say seven computers or laptops and they'll be all linked up to the same printer then that's what you can run all the others for professional and ultimate so let's get op on the bit of opening the box so my pen lid's gone now ah found it so just to open the top of the plastic bit up here and the bit there what's inside it you get the upgrading from Windows you get welcome to your PC simplified Windows 7 manual it's just basically a very quick up setup guide on how to open set up your Windows 7 how to run it quick check a quick checklist to get your PC ready before you install Windows 7 there's a few things to do you got to back up your files um, check if Windows 7 meets your PC requirements so a very good detailed colorful book which is very clear to read sorry about my autofocus it's playing up a bit so you can't really read it and media windows windows media center watch tv on your pc play to home group resume it from standby which is good i like it so much uh, at the back of the book you get new shortcuts to simplify every day so so you can just press them to open them up and bring all your tasks which are open, your programs very simple and easy so that's the manual 
next is upgrading from Windows XP so with this one you don't just have to have Windows Visa or Vista you can actually upgrade it from XP to Windows 7 just by using uh, following this guide there's only one two three four five points to use but I would make sure you back up everything before you install it on your XP because it will wipe everything so that's good that's good with people who don't want to spend money on getting Vista ready or buying Vista right. that's my product key don't want to show you that Right, you get two discs, the Windows 7, a home premium, 32-bit software for your lower settings on your laptop or computer. Let's see if the computer, if my camera is focused now, which is not, but this one's 32-bit. The next to it, or behind it, is the 64-bit software which is okay but I don't need it so it's a bit of a waste of money for that one and when it's, it's got a shiny outer end casing so you know it's genuine because it says it on there because Microsoft genuine on both discs and there's nothing on the back so very good buy indeed I'll be installing this one then I'll be installing Windows 7 Ultimate because that's what my computer can hold up stand up to is that powerful one or my laptop should I say so I'll be showing you that in my next video or I might just carry on with it now just show you some of the features so I've got my laptop already and set up bring it forward there we go right. sorry about this I've got the light on so if you can't really see don't worry so this is my background and then start is very useful it is very very detailed in what new picture icons which are very very good and I prefer this taskbar because it holds everything in one and then say let's open up this and drag that show there we go right now you see it's got two bars and then when you hover over it it splits the screen so you can see what's on this side and what's on this side so thank you you've been watching the UK review I hope you like the video please subscribe and comment I will leave a description down there or across there so thank you again